At Architecture and Vision, we have a dream that one day we will live in a planet where we will share all the resources. Water is the source of life. Without it, our life on Earth would be impossible. That is why we must ensure access to these fundamental resources for everyone. Hi, my name is Arturo Vittori and I would like to tell you our story. In 2012, we went to Africa and we discovered this beautiful country, Ethiopia. It was like traveling back in time to another age. However, we also saw with our eyes this dramatic situation of people lacking access to potable water. The World Health Organization estimates that 1.1 billion people on the planet don't have access to hygienic water. Women and children walk for several kilometers every day in order to bring back to their village water from questionable sources. Having seen all this, we made it our mission to find a solution and help them overcome their water problems. Architecture and Vision has designed a system called Warka Water that captures water from thin air based on local conditions. The name of the project comes from an endangered tree, the Warka tree, an important institution in the Ethiopian culture under which men, women, and children come together to socialize and make decisions. Warka water drives inspiration from nature, which as a result of evolution has developed amazing ways to capture as well as store water. We have developed several versions of the Warka and tested them with 10 full-scale prototypes starting in Ethiopia with the scaled version, which later evolved in Benin. And recently, we reached a new milestone with Warka Water 2 in Beirut, with several improvements and also a new look. Currently, we are working on Warka Water 3. The structure is comprised of five sections, which can be assembled manually by the inhabitants of the village without scaffoldings or heavy tools. Depending on the environmental conditions, Warka water can collect rainwater, it can harvest fog, and in the absence of rain or fog, it can capture dew. At Architecture and Vision, we're working hard to make Warka water a reality. We're creating custom meshes and devices such as Warkino to analyze local weather conditions and improve water collection. Since we embarked on this journey two years ago, we have acquired a wide range of experience and know-how by constructing and testing several Warka water prototypes. The next step is on-site testing. We plan to build a pilot Warka in Ethiopia in 2015. Other two Warkas will follow in 2016. After this test period, Warka water will be ready for large-scale production and distribution. There is still a lot of work to do. We need to conduct further research to develop the most efficient textile mesh. Our objective is Warka water to collect around 100 liters of water a day, be assembled in one day, and cost only $1,000. With your help, we will make Waka water happen. Please join and support our campaign. Thank you.